Hello, my beautiful family, and welcome back to DG360. My goodness. Fam is here with me live. You guys should join me in the mornings. We have a good time chilling out. Uh, we are talking Star Citizen Leaks. We are piped directly into the Star Citizen Leaks Discord now. You'll notice in our Discord, we have everything that uh, Star Citizen Leaks does. So you can actually just enjoy Star Citizen Leaks from the DG360 Discord server. Um, boom. Looks like new faces, maybe? The one on the right, you know, like, I'm not quite sure, because obviously you can mesh, uh, you can mesh people's faces together. And, and so I'm not quite sure if these are just actually new character renditions, or somebody's just, you know, meshing faces that currently exist. But it looks like if it's in Star Citizen Leaks, that perhaps we have uh, new faces. Not quite sure. New templates. Thank you, Dutch. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Um, this is cool. Like, a, a new uh, console area, new button added for lag pips, which is awesome. Uh, the rock costs 172k in game. Uh, it looks like there's a new classification of countermeasure chaff, which is cool. Uh, uh, chaff plus flares, now decoy plus noise. So we have uh, quite a few different uh, countermeasures added. The uh, Taurus, um, Constellation Taurus confirmed possibly. Oh yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, we're gonna show all of it, Dutch. Um, let's see here, what else do they have? Oh, the new cargo decks. Ooh, yeah industry time that looks kind of standard this is different you got like a rentals area that's cool i'm definitely digging that i'm definitely digging the looks of it i think there's more below but i'll go back up dutch i'll go back up if i missed it but i think there's actually more below displaying it i'm not quite sure we'll go back up to it uh there's a logistics info area and you know, I don't know how detailed the gameplay is. I saw a screen, and we'll we'll go down farther that showed like departures, but I'm not quite sure if it's just like a, a, a you know just like a mock load up screen or if it's actually like a mission load up screen. I'm imagining it's like a placeholder, but I'm not quite sure. Uh, Interstellar transport guild area. Um, here you can see like the hallway to get to the new like warehouse processing. Uh, container yard that's awesome digging it it's you know i like the fact that they're adding to the stations i like that you know initially we got a portion of the station and the stations are getting larger as we go uh, i think i think there's in terms of gameplay dev right now it's just mission oriented from what i'm hearing what's up weezer welcome to the stream um, this I wasn't sure of what I'm looking at here. It says clothing. So I'm not quite sure what to take from that. Um, yeah, like stores. I'm not quite sure exactly what to take from that. But this is, I mean, the, the, the fields from the cargo decks are really cool, man. You got like a legit warehouse going on as far as the design, you know, as far as the actual art work involved what's up santa good morning people are people are waking up fam is waking up um yeah like i i totally dig the feels of it i really dig the feels of these warehouse units these are great can't wait till those arcade games actually play something um a hater from star citizen leaks is saying merlin has been banned as in removed from the constellation Hmm. 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 New loading screen. And also building blocks will be able to pin it. Yeah, like I'm not quite sure what he's getting on about there. That's a little bit concerning to me. Um. 
this is this is this is what I was talking about earlier. This cargo dispatch screen. I think this just might be like a mock up, like the stuff we saw at Art Corp with the destinations, like the the uh, Genesis, uh, like leaving to and from places to shuttle people. I think this just might be a mock up, but boy, would it be cool if they hook this up into the quantum so that eventually you could see like trading routes and stuff of that nature. You know, like if this is something that is visible eventually to everybody, you could imagine like you're going to hear a lot of the industrial players screaming because you're going to see pirates using this as a means to figure out where to go. <laughs> I think they should do that. Keep it in, man. Add some danger to it, you know? Oh, yeah. So let's see here. What else do we have? The, here, here's the shotgun, the new bearing. I think it's a BR2 is what they're uh, classifying it as. This, this looks all types of fun. This looks all types of fun. Um, not quite sure what they're... Okay, the module selections. Uh, yeah, I'm not quite sure exactly what we're showing there, but this is great. This is wonderful. Buttons on your um, flight stick. It looks it appears to be where you arm and disarm missiles. Oh, that's sexy. Your pit button. Uh, what is GMB? That a gimbal? Like, what does GMB stand for? Not quite sure. Maybe you guys can tell me in the comments what's going on. Yeah, like, I love the fact that there's more, um, like, this is what they were talking about in the last Inside Star Citizen, uh, and we said this on the review, is, like, we're so happy there's more functionality with buttons. Uh, but, oh, look at that flip up. Look at that. Oh, is that quantum? Is that, like, a quantum button? That's pretty tight. Giant mother bucker, Weezer. Let's play the acronym game. I'm not quite sure what FPTN is either. You know what the pips are. QT looks like quantum. Oh, wow. Look at that. Quantum engaged. Oh, that's cool. They're, they're giving little animations to the buttons, man. Oh, my goodness. I think eventually they'll have VR, but it's not planned right now, Dev. But that, that I think, is eventually what the, what the long-term plan is. That's that's pretty kick ass. I I really like that. So there we go. There is some new features in 3.11 being leaked out and I will continue to keep you guys posted on the leaks as they arrive in the channel. Are you guys able to see that by the way? Go to the Discord when you can and let me know in the Discord if you guys can see that now. J Dubs and Jiro and Snow Fox and I are trying to make sure everybody can see these. Because apparently yesterday a couple people had some issues uh, looking at these. But we want to make it very convenient so that you can get all your leak news directly from the DG360 Discord server. Okay, good. All right. Getting professional. Thanks, Dutch. Thanks for letting me know right away, dude. Yeah, that's really important to us. So there's your leaks, guys. It's looking pretty good. I don't think it's terms of like the cargo decks that there's going to be a lot of new mission or a lot of new gameplay other than missions. So I think like right now, you're just going to have, you know, basic missions. I'm looking forward to what the rewards are going to be on these missions. I mean, if you think about it, a lot of industrial players are, are shipping cargo from A to B, making plenty of cash. So there has to be some type of like um, credit influx or boost or reward for people to say, OK, I want to start doing some of these missions hauling cargo. Uh, you know, the, the, the cool thing about the missions is it might add a little bit to the gameplay in terms of like, you know, feeling more part of the verse, but, um, they're definitely going to have to boost the incentive up just a touch in order to get people who are very accustomed to, you know, taking cargo already and, and taking it from A to B, which is my favorite way to trade. Like, like, let's be honest here. 
if you're a trader, if you're a hardcore trader, like one of your favorite ways to trade right now that's available to us in the game is to just find the most profitable cargo destination points, the lowest buy, the highest sell. That's really the gameplay that traders love to do on their own. It, like that is immersive. So in order for like traders to be able to find uh, like a, a, a higher payout, through missions you're going to have to see those rewards be increased you're going to i mean like if, if what i'm i guess what i'm trying to say is if if, if they're going to go where the money is that's what traders do so you know that's what most gamers do when they're trying to get their creds so like they're go, there's going to have to be additional incentive or these or these missions aren't going to be played i jumbled around that one sorry it's early i haven't i haven't had enough uh uh Coffee, which I'm not drinking coffee. I'm drinking tea. All types of confusion going on right now. <laughs> All right. Thanks, everyone. And comment because this is going to YouTube. Comment. Tell us what you think about what you're seeing. 3.11. We'll continue that as we go here.